I was born in Milano, Italy, but my family is actually full Egyptian. My mom was unfortunately、um, a bit abusive. Over time, the abuse got more aggressive, and my father felt helpless. At, I, at age eight, he took it upon himself to get counsel from the church, and the church said, "If you want your children to survive, you have to leave the country." And a day later, we woke up in the Middle East, in Egypt, and it was an absolute culture shock. We lived with strangers. I did not speak the language. I did not know the culture. Felt alone. Felt that we were helpless, and I didn't fully understand what was happening. Throughout this whole journey, I felt like God forsake me. I felt like God was not by my side. We came to the states when I was 10 years old, and、uh, um, I actually got saved later in high school. And what attracted me to Jesus was this understanding that there was more for me, that there was a reason for all of this, and that I couldn't find it on my own. There was one aspect though that I was not willing to surrender, and that was my Past my association of Egypt and my trauma, I didn't understand what God wanted me to do next, and it wasn't until I started to attend Mariners that I saw the lead for the Egypt ministry, and I started to chuckle to myself because I knew exactly what God wanted me to do. Jesus was saying, "You are going to Egypt," and being in Egypt after 20 years of not going back or even acknowledging the country really brought about. An insane amount of healing. I mean, decades and decades of pain, of trauma, of resentment, and they were replaced with absolute love for God, for people, for seeing every single individual as an image bearer of God. When you have Christ as the common factor, race, age, culture, food, all of it melts away, and we are now just family. God was with me the entire time, from my early years in Italy to our really tough times in Egypt. Through it all, I was never alone. Gesù era con me in Italia. Gesù era con me in Egypt. Jesus is with me now.